tell my guest um what what is syndication what do you mean what do you what do we mean by syndication yeah and and you know it, it sounds like a complicated word jay but when i um when i it was funny because I, I headed to ngit in 1996 because i um you know I, I had just passed my p exam that's where i graduated engineering but by that time i wanted to go into real estate so i walk across to the Rutgers library there's a book on the, on the shelf that says joint ventures and syndication i didn't even know what the word meant at that time you know so if you don't know what it means don't don't worry about it i knew what joint venture is and i took that book off the shelf and i opened the book and believe it or not the paragraph that literally shifted my mindset was that a syndication is basically a group of people with you know with a common you know goal in mind to invest in real estate and there's a band leader and that band leader could be you know could be a clerk, could be a lawyer, could be a banker, could be, you know, a, a, an engineer, could be a builder. It could be anybody. It's somebody who's good with people, you know, and bringing them together and being able to tell a story and have gravitational pull. And of course, you know, you know, make a couple bucks and, and it's, it's not that hard, you know, it's not rocket science. You know, we've tried that already. <laughs> you know, That's right. That's right. Well, you know, um, it's funny we're having this conversation about private money. Uh, private money for me had more of an impact on changing my real estate investing career more than anything else. And I sort of backed into it. I just didn't wake up one morning and say, hey, I think I'll go raise a bunch of private money. It's like when I lost my lines of credit at the bank back in 2008 and 2009, like everybody else, yep. I had to find a better way. And, and I they're just so, I mean, you know, in the real world, I mean, a real estate investor is just not going to do very many deals unless they're a wholesaler, unless they're a wholesaler, which, you know, I don't like working for tips. Um, but you know, in my single family house business, my average profits now are $71,000. So Ken, if you will allow me, I want to tell about this brand new private money guide that I just finished writing that, um, that uh, my, our guests can download for free. And here's the name of it right here. It's called seven reasons why private money will skyrocket your real estate business and help you build incredible wealth. I'm telling you, this book will get you on the fast track to getting private money for your real estate deals. And you can download it for free at www.jayconner.com forward slash money guide. That's J Connor, J A Y C O N N E R.com forward slash money guide. That will get you on the fast track to private money and getting a lot of it very, very fast.